let me share with you the heart of our niche program using the acronym PACT. P stands for platform. Our company serves as a platform for us to organize family bonding activities such as tech archery and prawning. Besides those activities, we have also organized a family bonding camp for the parents to come together and bond with their family. Besides these activities, A stands for appreciation. So the boys had the opportunity to appreciate their parents during the parade sessions. So they actually serve their parents food that they have prepared and crafts that they have made. They also had the opportunity to appreciate their parents through a video and also to say I love you to them. C stands for communication. We believe in the importance of having a good communication with our parents. So through the activities that we have organised, we are able to connect with our parents and partner together for the growth of our boys. T stands for transformation. We have organised Parents Talk to equip our parents with the skills to help to transform our boys and build their character at home. We also have activities such as Share a Gift in which we get the parents involved so that they can use those teachable moments when they serve together and teach them and build their character. Let us hear from Marcus and his family when they share about their experiences in Boys Brigade. I remember during the uh, parent, uh, during the BB camp at Sentosa Island, uh, BB actually bring in an experienced speaker to, to talk to the parents uh, while the kids is having fun and uh, I think it's a very good talk. Um, a lot of things that, uh, that we may have already know was brought up during the, the talk itself, particularly uh, about having the need to have a uh, strong bond with the kids and the techniques we use to uh, build up the relationship. To me, the most enjoyable part was when my father carried me and ran across the sand. It was one of the activities and it was quite comfortable on my father's back as when he ran there was a lot of wind blowing on me. Here in Second Company, we believe in developing boys to be servant leaders who make tangible contributions, not just to their school, but also their families and the community at large. To that end, we have partnered for many years with local VWOs, such as AWA, Rainbow Centre and Marine Parade Family Service Centre. In recent years, we've brought the boys to Chiang Mai, Thailand, where we partner with Water Alive Methodist Church to better develop the boys in terms of empathy, as well as exposing them to a new and unfamiliar surrounding. I chose to join this trip as I realised that it offered many valuable uh, lessons and values that would really help me to develop myself as a leader, both in the Boys' Brigade and in Victoria School. I, it also gave me the opportunity to go down to Chiang Mai to help uh, the less fortunate over there and allowed me to interact with people from different social backgrounds. It also gave me the opportunity to experience the life of the locals over there and allowed me to develop my sense of compassion and empathy and allowed me to care for others uh, apart from those that I'm close with. I went to, the, I went to a rural village in Chiang Mai, so this is the photo. Uh, so for, when we go there, we managed to play uh, a lot of games with the village children, teach them basic arithmetic skills and teach them basic English as well. So we had a lot of fun together. So looking at all these children, they live in not well-off conditions. Their houses are made of roof, uh, are made of wood and zinc roofs. So this is actually not able to keep them warm at night and it's a not very good material for the house and also for them they, did not, they, they wear all those um, hand-me-down clothing so this shows that they are not very well off living but they are actually very happy and very have a lot of fun with us so this made me realize that um, having being happy in your life is to have, have your friends and have activities and fun together and it doesn't and, and when you are rich, it doesn't mean that you can be happy. 
I felt very happy and satisfied after the trip as I was given the opportunity to serve the locals and I really gave my best when interacting with the locals. It also gave me many opportunities to develop myself as a leader and allowed me to gain a sense of confidence and sense of urgency. So you heard from our boys what they've learned, what they've experienced and the kind of impact the trip has had on their lives. We look forward to future trips where we bring future batches up to carry on this meaningful partnership. But at the same time, we acknowledge that there are plenty of needs right here in Singapore and we encourage all BB companies to look beyond their programme to find practical ways that they can help those in the community.